All right, Superman and Lois. That's right. It is uh, coming to Blu-ray and DVD. I want to give you the rundown on that, the drop dates, and all of the details that was sent over. Uh, so you can uh, make plans to get this. I consider this possibly one of the best shows that's been on television in the last year or so. It's really, really good. Highly recommend the show. Can't wait to uh, sit down and go through it all again. So let me get you all of these details because this is uh, this was really, really good stuff. I was very excited to uh, see this. Let me blow this up for you and uh, get you uh, all of the details they sent over here for us hang on here that's not it remove that here click here nope that's the wrong thing so anyway no just a great show i don't know if you've uh, been able to catch any of it or not um really really have enjoyed the episodes that i've seen and um i think i only missed one i missed one episode anyway uh, not unhappy about it but uh, definitely can tell you that it was a uh, very, very good and um, very been very, very happy about this show. And it's 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 really been great. So here's the details. Um, new extended versions of all 15 episodes. Uh, it's going to be arriving on Blu-ray and DVD October 19th. Superman saves the world, saves his family when Superman and Lois, the complete First season releases on Blu-ray and DVD October 19th, 2021 from Warner Brothers Home Entertainment featuring never before seen extended versions of all 15 action-packed episodes from that first season. Goes through the different prices for you. So $24.98 for DVD, $39.99. And, oh, that's that Canada's prices there. So $29.98 for Blu-ray. So it is also available for digital and it will be on HBO Max on August the 20th. So you'll be able to catch up. If you're not, if you already have HBO Max, you'll be ahead of the game here. So let's read some of the storylines they give us for. After years of facing supervillains, monsters, and alien fighters intent on wiping out the human race, one of the world's greatest superheroes and comic book's most famous journalists come face to face with one of their greatest challenges ever dealing with all the stress, pressures, and complexities that come with being working parents. And that sounds like it was going to be this horrible, woke, uh, superheroes don't matter, family drama does type thing. But what's really cool in the show is how Clark is trying to balance both, and they all react together, and no one is demeaned or belittled. The two boys are just fantastic in all their scenes. Um, the cast is phenomenal. Just a really great show. Anyway, so this runs down the um, different details here. I, I mean, I love all the characters in the show. I really thought they've just done such a great job uh, with that. And uh, this is definitely part of it. So it talks about uh, Blu-ray and DVD features include Superman, Alien Spirit, Superman, and Lois, Legacy of Hope, Never Alone, Heroes and Allies, and the DC Fandom panel, Superman and Lois. So there's 15 one-hour extended episodes. I mean, we'll be seeing some additional footage that might hopefully get everybody excited to be able to see more of it. I actually thought there were some just really great twists and turns in the season. Uh, some surprise characters. I thought bringing in um, some of the uh, other comic book elements without it being very like almost like cheesy because i didn't feel like the show ever got cheesy i think this is definitely one of the best portrayals of superman i thought he was really really good one of the things i liked was um so with the with the boys you know you have one that's the jock one that's kind of the nerd they don't know if either of the kids are going to have powers and obviously it's the nerdy one that does but he's trying to he's trying to learn about his powers the other one's having issues and there's like girl issues and there's like it, it i don't know there's just so many elements is so good and there's a couple fight scenes like there's one shot where the guy is going to throw down against superman and he floats a little bit after taking the punch and uses his freeze breath to freeze him and then punch him and it was just shot so well and done so well it's hard to believe this is like a tv show so so good and then of course the twists and turns you have the 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 luther character you have uh, uh some of the other stuff that if you haven't seen I, I wouldn't want to spoil for you so i don't know if you've had a chance to uh watch this show yet or not uh highly 
highly recommend it. Um, really looking forward to it. So let me run down uh, some of the other details here for you. Uh, the, this lists the names of the uh, different episodes. Uh, yeah, so really, really great. So digital uh, purchase allows cu customers to instantly stream and download all the episodes to watch anywhere and anytime on their favorite devices. Digital movies and TVs are available for the various retailers. So you can get this through Amazon, uh, iTunes, Google Play, Vudu, and others. That would be um, uh, something you want to consider, especially if you do not have HBO Max and can watch it that way. HBO um, has been a really great partner for uh, Warner Brothers in this regard, so all of their stuff is there. And DC, of course, is uh, kind of extended their universe through the CW shows. This one in particular has proven to be one of the biggest fan favorites by not getting into some of the general politics and, and woke themes that we've seen in other shows. That's just not what you're going to uh, see on this show. And I tell you, I was, I, I've been so pleasantly surprised. I think that you'll enjoy some of the family drama without it being like politicized family drama. I think you'll see that all the cast has been great and uh, hopefully it's something that you do enjoy. So that's something you to think about. There are your dates. Uh, just again, make sure you got them for you. Uh, shelves date is October 19th, but there are some other drop dates that'll be sooner. And of course, HBO Max is August 20th. So you'll be able to get a copy uh, for yourself. Mark your calendars accordingly. All right. Well, hopefully you enjoyed that. I appreciate your time and I am Pops.